Hello everyone, welcome to another Exchange 2019 video. My name is Ed. And in this video I want to show you how to remove an email alias from a distribution group using PowerShell. Now, if you are new to Exchange and you're not comfortable with PowerShell, if you wanted to remove or add an alias, you would come to the Exchange Admin Center and the recipients, you click on Groups. And you can either create a new group or double click a group. And under email options, you can see that I've got an alias uh, set here, which I want to remove using PowerShell. So if I wanted to remove this using the EAC, I would click the minus button and then save and it will delete it. But we're not gonna do that uh, in this video. So I've already got the command ready. So basically what this does is it sets the distribution group. This is the group that I'm talking about, which is here. And I'm specifying email addresses and then I'm actually removing my group too. So if I copy this and I paste it in and press enter, <coughs> it's pretty quick to do. So I've essentially removed that. If I go back here, let's just do a refresh and I go to email options, there you can see that the pre on the previous screen I had it open, it showed my group two, it's now been removed. So that's pretty much how simple it is to manage exchange using PowerShell through the command line. And if you are familiar with PowerShell, this is maybe a command line or command that you want to add to your group of commands, especially if you want to do this on scale, if you want to remove a alias from multiple groups, it's a lot easier just to you know, get it all ready in Notepad and then run it all one time and then it'll remove it. And thank you very much for watching.